So this is how we use the lips coloring. So something like a lipstick. So basically we open the magic touch two. We go to the blue module, which is the retouch module. We open the lips menu and we simply click on color. So once we see this layer with all the colors, which are, by the way, the most used lipstick colors, generally speaking, we click on the mask and we have to select our lips. I've already created a selection. So I just re-click again on the mask if it's not active and just paint it white. So something like this, then I can deselect just with command D on control D if you are on Windows. So now you can just deselect the colors you don't want to use. And for now, we are seeing this earth color, which is very nice. And of course, we can use the fill slider or the opacity slider to change the strength of how much of this lipstick is visible. Then we can deselect it, for example, and activate the bright pink. If it's too much, we can lower the fill and fit our needs. So something like this could be very nice. We have the red passion, which is, of course, for this kind of image, maybe, of course, it's too much. So we can lower the opacity, let's say, 240, and it looks really great. Keep in mind that different photos can need different kind of values. So maybe the red passion here is too strong, but on some other image, for example, a 70% would be just perfect. Okay. So each image needs its own values and adjustments. So these are the most used colors already preset for you so you don't have to think about it by any means so let's for example choose this rosa happy and this is our final image with this nice lipstick applied to the lips like it's her own lipstick I hope you find this tutorial useful, even it's very simple. If you still don't have the Magic Touch 2 panel, you can find the link in the description and get it hopefully with some nice promotion going on right now.